Hello, so today is June 26th. It has been March, three months since me and my husband went to Dominican Republic to get our teeth done by Dr. Gonzaga. Not even him because he wasn't there. Um, I think he just stays at the Columbia office because he's not there. And we are already looking for a new place to get our teeth fixed. Um, I'll just try to show you guys a close up maybe. And you know, I like the bottom teeth the best. So the only issue, so my husband, which he's not trying to get on camera because he's really upset. His issue is he has had about seven of his veneers pop off, seven. You guys know me, I had an implant, so this is still not even a tooth here. This is, a, um, a, a, what is it called? A fake tooth? I don't know what to call it. Um, but yeah, so he's upset. Um, for me, I personally um, don't like the color. And in addition to that, I have been back to my regular dentist here. Um, and they're telling both of us, me and my husband, that they were incorrectly put on, um, and that we probably need to go ahead and get our teeth done either, you know, obviously with them or with somewhere else due to the fact that they're put on incorrectly and they're probably going to start, we're going to start developing cavities, which means what? We're going to have to get the teeth pulled and then what? Another implant or something in my mouth. Um, how they explained it is, you know, veneers are su supposed to go on, you know, like contact lens, like right on the front of the tooth for like a little bit of the underneath, but I guess how ours are put on, I don't know. They're put on incorrectly. I'm not a dentist, so I don't know exactly, but we've had two dentists tell us that they're put on incorrectly. Um, he's had three. Because he had to find places to get the veneers put back on here. Um, and we live in North Carolina. So everyone, yeah. And they're pretty much tired of him. Because he keeps calling, you know, to get teeth put on. And they're like, look, dude, <laughs> we're you're helping you out. But you need to either, you know, do something. So he, it, and it's different teeth. It's not the same ones. Once he's got them put back on here, those ones have not came off yet. Um it's been all different teeth all over his mouth, all over front tooth, side tooth, back to all of the teeth in his mouth are coming out. I'm so lucky that mine have not. I think we had two different people who I believe put our teeth, our veneers on in Columbia. I'm not sure, obviously, because we were in different rooms and, you know, not a whole lot of English spoke. Um, so I know who put mine on and he knows who put his on, but we don't know if it was the same person. <laughs> um anyways what else so we're probably either going to have to spend money and get everything done correctly here in the states so it's probably going to run us about 20 25 000. um or our next best option is going on a trip to turkey i never thought about going to turkey but they do do some extremely extremely their their dental work is top notch i will say that um he's like you know i wish we would have went there first it is what it is um waste of money we did spend a lot of money on these teeth um and they're just a little too white for me personally he, his white teeth they look great on him this is a number two they're just so white I'm going to go down <laughs> a color. I'm definitely going to go with the white as your eyeball um, thing that they tell you here in the States. Don't get teeth whiter than that. I'm going to go with that um, because these are a little too white for me. And I think they're just a little too, I don't know what the issue is. It is not right. You know what I mean? I don't know. But... If you guys have any questions, again, we got our teeth done. We were supposed to go to Columbia to Dr. Um, 
Gonzaga's office. But during the time we went, the COVID measures were still in place. So we ended up just going to DR because they did not have any um, vaccination requirements. Um, so now that things are kind of, you know, going back down, we're definitely going to go ahead and probably head over to Turkey. Um, of course, we'll keep you guys updated on what happens there if, if not we're gonna we're gonna still try to find somewhere here in the states that whose work is exactly what we want um and we're going to the exact dentist that we chose because it, it's kind of sucks that i can't really tell you guys if dr gonzaga's work is terrible or it was just the fact that we did not go to his primary office we went to you know some random dentist in dr at this point who has his name on the door who has dr gonzaga's name on the door um it sucks um it's definitely a lot of money spent but we're definitely gonna go ahead and find another place to get our teeth done at Sorry, again, I'll give you guys another look. And like I said, this one is a temporary. Um, so by the time we find another dentist, I, you know, I got to figure out <laughs> that too. I got to hope that whatever implant they did put in my mouth, that they can match it wherever we go. I don't know how that's going to go because I do not want a bridge in my mouth at all. Um, okay. Okay. If you guys have any questions comment below if you guys need a uh, you know i answer because i don't you know not that many comments so i will answer you guys and if you have any additional questions um of course i'll make a follow-up video whenever we figure out what we're going to do with our smiles thank you bye